There are certain things that happen in the world of sports which leave fans speechless in disbelief and asking, did that just happen? What transpired yesterday on the track at London Stadium was one of those moments. In the history of track and field, there are very few athletes who can be described as invincible, unbeatable, and untouchable. Usain Bolt is one of those. Coming into yesterday's 100-meter final, the Jamaican sprinter had dominated the event for nearly a decade. But on his final 100-meter race of his life, just when we thought he would pull off yet another victory, he couldn't finish strong down the stretch and would have to settle for third behind Justin Gatlin and Christian Coleman. But honestly, it didn't matter what place he came in, because before the gun went off, he already cemented himself as the greatest sprinter who ever stepped on the track. But see, the reason we love Usain Bolt is not because of his eight Olympic gold medals or his 11 world championship golds or all the world records he established. We love him because of everything that he represents, his charisma, his energy, his infectious personality, the way he takes time to acknowledge every fan in the stadium at the end of every race. And most importantly, the fact that he stayed clean in an era where doping was prevalent among sprinters. He sent a message to kids around the world that you can be legendary without cheating to get there. Now maybe the defining moment of how much Bolt is revered is summed up in this photo right here. Just after beating Bolt in the 100 meter dash, Justin Gatlin got on his knees to worship the greatest sprinter of all time. Now that's respect. The thing is, Gatlin's genuflect is reflective of how the world views Usain Bolt, bowing down to pay respect to the greatest who ever did it. On behalf of sports fans around the world, thank you for the memories, Mr. Bolt. All right, now switching gears to baseball.